Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. I have to start by telling you that there's a lot of fraud going on. There are people who are using my email address, posing as me, contacting companies, promising reviews, companies sending out products, and then a couple weeks later they get back with me and say, hey, when are you going to put up the video? When are you going to do the review? I have no idea what they're talking about. They are getting frauded by people who are posing as me, and I'm sure it happens with many other people who make videos. I have others that are stealing my videos and using them. Like, I just checked this one person. 59 of my videos they took and are using daily. So I'm having them removed, and right when that's happening, others are being uploaded. So I'm, I'm just continuously trying to work through this fraud. I had no idea that this would ever be a thing with a YouTube channel, but it is, and it's alive and well. Putting that aside, Cheaper Than Dirt is at it again. Now, before I get into this, I have to tell you that many companies that make the bulk of their profit from ammo is probably hurting right now. They're not getting the product in from the ammunition manufacturers, and they're not able to turn over ammo and make profits but cheaper than dirt is amongst the worst they are not cheaper but they are dirt because they don't care about the second amendment people they don't care about anything other than their profits now i have people tell me yeah you don't understand economics you know you don't understand what it takes to make a profit well i don't understand much i will grant you that but i do understand economics i own two businesses and have a full-time job I think I know what I'm talking about when I say that Cheaper Than Dirt is a horrible company. Actually, I've had a couple people contact me on two separate occasions and let me know that they worked for Cheaper Than Dirt. It's a toxic environment. The owners are profit-driven. They could care less about the Second Amendment. They could care less about the products they sell. They only want the profits, and it's a high-stress work environment and they said they hated it and when they left that job they felt this weight off of their shoulders because of the amount of pressure that they put on their employees so they're not getting the profits because the ammunition manufacturers aren't pumping out ammo they're not sending it out to the distributors and so what do they do they raise the prices on their other products to offset that difference now what does cheaper than dirt do uh, Viewer just let me know this today. I looked it up. I, I was shocked. A lot of people love the G2C. This is the G3C. They want to get their hands on it. It offers some upgrades from the G2C. What is Cheaper and Dirt sell it for? This product here, $780.48 for the G3C. The MSRP is 305 All right. To give you an idea of what their scam is you know they figured it's a hot item a lot of people want it let's you know over double the msrp and see if we can get any suckers out there to buy it and they do they do you know people tell me they get mad at me for making a video like this but then they go out and buy for people cheaper than dirt and they tell me well in your face because i bought this uh, you know what i don't care if you want to get ripped off you want to throw your money down the toilet for you know, some company that could care less about you, you go for it. Most people wouldn't do that. How about a CZ Scorpion Evo 3 Micro? It's a great firearm. Nobody's doubting that. $3,008.10 for that. Here's another example. Now, I love the CMMG Banshee. All right, I rave about the Banshee. They are selling a Banshee in 9mm. $4,721.45. Can you believe this company? And there are many more. I could have gone on and on, but I don't want to bore you to death with all of these guns that they're trying to rip people off with. Now, granted, you may get the gun, but then what are you going to do? You're going to need ammo. So what are they doing with ammo prices? They are skyrocketing. Now, a lot of people get back with me and say, well, they're skyrocketing everywhere. I know that. Of course they are. It's, you know, something I'm not, I already mentioned that. I already talked about that. But that that's a fact. But cheaper than dirt is the worst. 250 rounds of 223, $399.89. 250 rounds. So now you're looking at 
shipping of $15, that's reasonable, $15 shipping, you're looking at $1.66 around. So to load up your 30 round magazine, you're looking at $49.80 to shoot 30 rounds of 223, and they have the same ripoff prices with 556. Five, so that's what's going on there. I would say, if you can, in terms of ammo and guns, I would wait it out. You know, I'm waiting it out. I'm, I'm doing what I need to do. I have a supply that took years to build up. And I am continuing to buy when, you know, the opportunity presents itself. But I would not jump into this and hit the panic button because some dirtball company like Cheaper Than Dirt is trying to rip you off. Because we had the same thing in 2012 when people made huge regrets over the amount they paid for guns and ammo only to watch them drop down and cost after so long now we don't know when that's going to happen but eventually it will happen and i just don't want you to get ripped off the way these companies are getting ripped off by other people posing that they are me if you like videos like this please subscribe and share i always appreciate thumbs up button thanks for watching and you guys be safe